Imagine that you are a 50 year old woman who spends all of her time in her house. She doesn't get out much, she doesn't have many friends, but she does watch a lot of TV. This woman, let's call her Barbara, spends over four hours every day with the news playing in the background, constantly listening to stories of violence, robbery, and people being unalived. Now, because of this, and because Barbara doesn't get out much, she thinks that the world is a lot scarier and dangerous than it actually is. She is more fearful of the public, less trusting of her neighbors, and she ultimately has a very negative perception of the world. And this is actually a common condition called mean world syndrome, where the content you take in creates a cognitive bias in your brain that shifts the way you perceive the world. Now, you might be thinking, well, hey, I don't watch the news, so this doesn't affect me, but it almost certainly does. Especially since we moved into an era of algorithmic recommendations, these algorithms, with what they show you, are subconsciously programming your perception of the world. Another example of this is if you only ever look at beautiful people, you're going to assume the average person looks a lot better than they do, and you're also going to be more critical of how you look. So it's important to be mindful about the content you're consuming and how it makes you feel, and at the end of the day, if it doesn't make you feel good, try and go out and find something that does.